Recently, one of my friends uh, struggled at bridging, so I figured I'd make him a special tutorial just for him. Now, uh, just kidding, I'm planning on doing this video for a while, but uh, that's a good excuse to do it, so uh, enjoy the video. Let's start with the basics. So as you can see, I've gone back three blocks from the edge of the cliff. I've placed a block, and I'm standing on that block. You can kind of just hold down right click and run forward from here. Just make sure that your crosshair is aimed straight down at the ground. Now this bridging method is super easy. It works for controller, uh, keyboard and mouse, mobile, you name it. It's just one of the more simple bridging methods, so it's not actually one of the main ones I'm showing you here today. It's just kind of a good starting point to get you going. Just make sure to give yourself at least two blocks here to get you going for this really simple speed bridge. You can do more, but it's really not necessary. Now let's try something a bit more advanced. Okay, next up is the MJ bridge, named after uh, the YouTuber MJ, who I guess you could say kind of invented it. To start off, you're going to want to have four to five blocks of free space. You can do three, but at that point, it's kind of uncomfortable. You can use this as kind of just like a start to get yourself into a jump bridge. Just kind of give yourself two or three blocks in between you and the start of the bridge to kind of give yourself some extra space. Now let's get into some more details. Now while starting this bridge, you're going to want to have your crosshair about two to three blocks away from you. You're also going to want to have your crosshair uh, on the bottom half of the block that you're starting your bridge on. Now once you're out, you can start running and bobbing your crosshair up and down to make sure that it maintains the bridge. Now if you're trying to jump while doing this, you've got to make sure that you're bobbing your crosshair because if not, then the bridge is eventually going to stop and you're probably going to fall off. Now both controller players and keyboard players can easily do this, but if you're trying to do the jump version of it, then mostly just keyboard players are going to be able to do this. Now this is my personal favorite because you can kind of just start at the edge of a cliff and go from there. Now for this one, you're going to want to start on the last block at the very edge of the cliff and have your crosshair in the same position as mine. And you're going to be placing a block right here. This is where you're going to be starting your bridge. And you're going to do pretty much the same thing you did for the first one. You're just going to hold down right click and run. And then aim your crosshair at the ground. Straight down to the ground. And your crosshair is going to be about four pixels up from the bottom of the block. Of course, you know, that's an imaginary block. When you're actually bridging, there's not going to be a block there. Because you have to bridge. That's just to give you a general idea of where to aim your crosshair. And now you can bridge like a pro after, you know, practicing this a lot. Hey, you made it to the end of the video. Wow, congrats. If you enjoyed this video, consider moving your thumb literally two inches up your screen and clicking the like button. If that's too much work, which, you know, I totally understand. Uh, consider hitting the subscribe button instead. I think it's a little bit closer, maybe a little bit easier for you. And uh, just follow my instructions, and I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.